the man who created Healthcraft Cookware, known as the third best cook in America, author of numerous cookbooks, Deacon Jones. No, Charles Knight. <laughs> hey, how you hey, doing? Hey, Charles, all right. All right. This you. is the man. He said it's okay as long as you're the third best. He's got third some best. Uh, pretty good recipes in that book. Well, oh, I wish I would known that. I would have cooked a couple of them. By the way, before you start on the Sloppy Jones, or as you start, we forgot to tell why Deacon is in town, because he is on a mission to promote high blood pressure, not to promote it, not to promote but, it, to, but, but to keep people from getting it. <laughs> but, but to stimulate awareness. Yeah. You know, um, high blood pressure is a silent killer and is doing a lot of damage to our society. We, um, we, we along with Ernie, Ernie Banks, you know, Mr. Cub oh, yeah, and Whitey Ford and myself, we've, we've joined together and we're covering the United States to, on behalf of Astro Pharmaceutical to to impress upon people the importance of getting the blood pressure checked. You see, we have a big problem in this country, as most of the people out there in the audience can tell you, that last year, $274 billion was spent on high blood pressure related illnesses, like, like a heart attack, stroke. You see, now, we have, a, a, we have a commitment to make, too, as human beings, in order to drive the cost of health care down. And the only way you can deal with these catastrophic illnesses is early detection. Yeah. You're looking at a man here, last year, this time, was going under the knife for prostate cancer, okay? But through early detection, I caught mine in the early stages, took it out, and didn't even have to take chemo. Oh, that's great. You see, so I'm a believer and an advocate and early detection. of early detection. And, and what we're trying to do is get these people, man, because it's killing a lot of people, innocent people. Oh, absolutely. Mm. Well, we're going to add to blood pressure right here. Well, the there goes the sausage. The we'll take them out of the sausage. No, no, we ain't giving up everything. <laughs> actually, it, it, actually, it is a low-fat recipe. It's only about 10 grams of fat. And it's pretty easy to uh, cook. It's like Sloppy Joe's, only mm -hmm. we changed the recipe. And Jack, I'm gonna let you do the onion, okay? Oh my! Why can't he do the onion? Well, he's got to cook better than I do. Yeah, but it's more fun when you do the onion. So I'll oh, let you do, do the onion. Here. Just make sure that thing's secure. Now this, this is, is the old you... thing where oh, yeah, it makes yeah. you. Cry. I know. This, this I'll is let uh, you know how to it. chop uh, celery. I'll let you oh, chop sure. the celery, okay? And the way you make this recipe is very simple. First thing you want to do is put the uh, uh, put the um, uh, sausage in, which I'm not sure I'm, I should at this point, but uh, oh, yeah, well, that's how you get the flavor. That's good. That's yeah. good. That's real good. That's good. All right? You did a good job there. All right? Okay, well, Jack, you want to squeeze the uh, squeeze the sausage in there? Oh, yeah. I'll, I'll take that. That I can do. See? There you <laughs> go. It's right out either end. All right? <laughs> so we cut the... Uh, Sometimes it looks gross, folks. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I'm not a cook. All right. <laughs> we get rid of that. Now, to the sausage, you add your celery and onions. I'm going to let you put the onions in first. The onions? Wait a minute. i got to clean that out of there first. Just, oh, man. Start, you did a nice job there, Jack. Start to get a little teary Hands are going to smell like onions all day. Oh, I know. <laughs> all right. And to that, we're going to add the celery. All right. Ah. So you saute the celery. <laughs> Try to keep, thank you. <laughs> all right. You make... want to try to uh, saute the celery uh, and the onions together with the sausage. And to that, you add your peppers. Now, this is Sloppy Joe's, like, except we're well, calling them Sloppy, Sloppy Jones. Jones. Actually, yeah. I created the recipe, a recipe especially for you, Mr. Jones. Well, good. So this all is right. different, because I ain't seen all that stuff. If Burger there. King or uh, McDonald's are listening, remember. That's right. And these <laughs> could be a hit, because I yeah. smell Sloppy that stuff Jones over there. Sloppy Jones are good. Now, once great. you've got the sausage, you've got the onions in here, you've got the peppers, what we're going to do is we're going to add uh, turkey. Oh, I can do that. Right. Turkey. One pound of turkey goes in here. And that takes the place of the hamburger, so it's lower in fat. Oh. All right? And you don't want to you put that... you got a label in there. All right? And you're all set. You just let that saute, and once that's sauteed, you add the rest well, of the Well, you have to mix it up. Great. Well, I'm well, going to let you do that during the break. Well, we'll take a break. Be back in a moment with Charles and Deacon Jones. Great, man. If you'd like a copy of today's Healthcraft recipe, please send a self-addressed stamped envelope to... P.O. Box 262502, Tampa, 33685. Oh, look at that. That's okay. the uh, nice now we product right there. Finish this off. Spaghetti sauce. Oh. All right. A little bit of hot. Uh, oh, not too much of that. Peppers. Oh. Okay. About a you tablespoon of Dale steak sauce. Not too much. Uh -huh. All right, and the secret ingredient, monkey dust. The monkey oh, dust. Okay. Monkey dust, and there's no salt in that. And then you just let that cook, and it comes out to look just like 
this. Oh, we've got to try one of these. Isn't that beautiful? Yep, and rice. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we've got to try then, one of these. That looks great. What you want to do is you just put it over the, the buns. Put it on your buns. Like you see here. <laughs> hey, by the and way. you're all set. Deacon Jones urges you to go get your blood tested. We'll see you tomorrow with a cast from Cats. Folks from Cats, the play. Thank you, Deacon Jones and Charles Knight. Get it checked. Get your buns.